This video will show how to run VirtualBox disk images in a RAM disk. There may not be much practical reason to do this, but it is fun to make it work. Okay, let's get into Ubuntu Linux. We're in. Okay, let's go ahead and run some programs. There's GIMP. And let's go ahead and try Blender now. Maybe render the window. We'll try Android 7.1 Release Candidate. Now I'll show you how this was done. The software used is MDisk 2.0.9, 7-zip 18.01, and VirtualBox 5.2.6. All are a free download at the websites given. There are free Linux disk images available at osboxes.org, virtualboximages.com, and virtualboxes.org. We will find that RAM disks are faster than SSDs. The speed of the RAM disk depends on the speed of the computer's RAM. 1600 RAM was used in this tutorial. It is a good idea not to use all the computer's RAM for the RAM disk. The computer needs some RAM allocated to it to operate. RAM disks will not hold data when the computer is off or restarted. If installing programs to a RAM disk, it is a good idea to uninstall the programs or back up the RAM disk before restarting the computer. Sometimes to uninstall a program that was lost on a RAM disk, the RAM disk with the same letter drive must be created again. The program must be installed to the RAM disk, then uninstalled. MDisk and 7-zip have already been installed on this computer. I'll go ahead and make the RAM disk I'll right mouse click and go to the control panel and inside of the control panel we'll have mdisk virtual disk driver. I'll select that, click on mount new. The size of the virtual disk will be 7 gigabytes. Now this computer has 16 gigabytes installed in it. A virtual disk of 7 gigabytes will allow for 5 gigabytes to be used for the virtual disk image and 4 gigabytes to continue to operate the computer. The drive letter will be R, and I'll click on OK. We need to format the disk, so I'll do that now. The RAM disk is all set to be used. Now I'll go ahead and install VirtualBox to the RAM disk. It's not necessary that you do that, but I choose to do that because it runs faster. I'll browse to the local disk R and I'll make a folder called VirtualBox. I'll click on OK. Next, next, yes, install. Okay, now that VirtualBox is installed, I can go ahead and place the disk images I've downloaded off of the website into the RAM disk. So I'm going to select one of them. It'll be Ubuntu 17.10. I'll right mouse click, go to 7-zip, open archive, go into the folder, and drop the content into local disk R. It may take a few minutes for this to copy because the hard disk is not as fast as the RAM disk. Okay, it is now ready. I 
I'll select new. We'll have Ubuntu Linux version 16 bit. Next, allocate about five gigabytes. Next, we'll use the existing virtual hard disk. I'll go to the RAM disk R, select the virtual disk image, click on open, create. Then I'll go into settings and allocate processor cores. This computer has four cores, so I'll allocate three to the virtual disk image and one will run the computer. I'll click on OK and start. The password is osboxes.org. Okay, we're all set to use Linux. If you wish to use GIMP and Blender, you can find them in the software package here. And simply search for them. Have fun using Linux within the RAM disk.